Hello guys, today we're going to learn how to add the cheats feature to your app. Start creating the app. Under selection section, enter app name. Choose a category and click on next button. Choose a theme for your app and click on next button. Under design section, click on view all and search cheat. Now click on Cheat to add the page to your app. Click on Connect button to connect Google Sheets with your app and allow permissions. Once your Google account is connected to your app, three, three drop-down menus will appear. From here, you can select Spreadsheets, Cheats, and Permissions. Select a spreadsheet. It will show all the sheets available in that particular spreadsheet. Select sheet that you want to show in your app. If you want, you can change permissions of the sheet from here. Please note every permission has its unique functionality, such as read only, gives permission to app users to read the sheets only, adds only, gives permission to app users to add data in the sheet, update only, gives permission to app users to update data in the sheet. Delete only gives permission to app users to delete data from the sheet. Adds and update gives permission to app users to add, add and update data in the sheet. Update and delete give permissions to app users to update and delete data from the sheet. Adds and, and deletes give permission to app users to add and delete data from the sheet. All changes gives permission to app users to read, add, delete, update data in the spreadsheet. Let's select add and update for now. Now comes cheat name. If you want, you can change cheat name, but these changes will reflect on the app only, not on the Google Sheets. Also, you have the option to change sheet icon. Scroll down. Here comes column name showcasing all the columns present in your worksheet. You have the option to update column's name, but the updated column's name will be reflected on the app only. In column type, you can select appropriate type that justifies your column data. However, by the default column type is set to text. If you want, you can hide columns by ticking, tick marketing the checkbox of the respective column. Now comes required. If you want, you can make columns mandatory by tick marketing the checkbox of the respective column. The required field will be disabled if you have selected add only and delete only in permissions drop down menu. Click on save sheet button to see the reflection on simulator. Once you save any sheet, then you can't change spreadsheet and cheat, but you you do have the option to change permissions. However, if you don't want to show any sheet, then you can delete it. Next comes leg language settings. Under this section, you will find all the default text already displaying on your app. If you update any language settings text from here, it will immediately start reflecting in your app once user reopens sheet page. If you want, you can customize your cheat page from page style and color scheme section. That's it for now. Thank you for watching.